Several years of hellish pain is now apparently over for a 49-year-old man from Randers. He defied the Danish doctors and went to Ukraine to be treated with stem cells from a human embryo, a controversial treatment not being used in Denmark. Today, Jacob Schatz Jacobsen is a happy man. For more than 10 years, he had been living with severe pain in the legs, caused by diabetes he has had since early childhood. But stem cell therapy at a clinic in Kiev, Ukraine, has changed his life. Occasionally, I have had very severe pain in my legs. Not all the time, but sometimes. Very severe pain. I actually doubted that I could ever walk to my car. And that pain is completely gone. It has not been there since I got home. Despite doctors' warnings and concerns from his family, Jacob chose to go to the M-cell clinic in Ukraine, offering treatment with stem cells from seven-week-old aborted human embryos. It was a big decision to make, to get down there and undergo treatment. Afterwards, it has been something that has simply changed my life completely. These pictures are from the M-cell clinic's website, and some claims that they use a patented stem cell therapy. The treatment can help diabetes, age-related problems, Alzheimer's, Parkinson's cancer, multiple sclerosis, allergies, asthma, and other diseases. One of the leading stem cell researchers in Denmark will not deny that it may have some effect. It has been documented that stem cell therapy may be effective for patients with Parkinson's. I certainly would not deny that there may be an effect of something like this with other patients. It's just totally unproven at this time. Precisely the lack of evidence on the effectiveness of this treatment is one of the reasons we are not using this kind of stem cell therapy in Denmark yet. There are no definite plans to practice stem cell therapy with stem cells of the kind you are talking about here in Denmark. It's probably at least five, perhaps ten years away. Jacob Strauss Jacobson did not have time to wait. He is a contractor, and the drugs he took for the pain in his legs affected a central nervous system, to the extent that operating the big machines in the near future might have been impossible. Although Jacob would like to have stem cell therapy available in Denmark, he does not blame the Danish doctors he has been treated by. My doctors do all they can for me here, so I've taken responsibility for my life and chose my own way. Well, this is basically what I wanted to say. Jacob Schatz Jacobson spent 7,500 euros on travel, accommodation and treatment in Ukraine.